Hey guys, D-Mike here for another episode of Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. We're about to take a tour of the fruity factory. Perfect time of year to do it. Perfect time to subscribe, to comment on videos, and to like what you're seeing. I've been seeing a lot of those things happening. A lot of growth on the channel. In recent history. Thank you everybody for following along and helping keep the channel in good shape and thriving. I appreciate everybody's help. Watching everything grow and flourish has made me very happy. I love making the content for everybody. Hopefully you enjoy watching it. That's why we're here. So, once again, thank you everybody for following along and Paying attention to the content, I probably shouldn't have done that. I actually need one of these bad boys to come over here. Oh, okay, well that would have worked if I wouldn't have messed that up. I don't know if I can roll jump onto these or not. Nope. <laughs> the game is not kind. All right, can you respawn the paint? Okay. I think we have some Dixie barrels. We do. Let's go ahead and add one of those to our inventory. There she is. Our ever-present con paint. Oops. This jump's a little bit trickier than I thought it would be. Come on, game. Throw me a bone. We're being pretty seedless right now. I do believe there's a... A bonus! You guys all know how much I love doing these. But yes, the channel's been taken off a little bit. The things that I don't do is I don't take a day off for this channel. But yes, I've enjoyed making the content for however long it's been. The big uptick in subscribers and views is well noted. I appreciate that from all of you. Thank you so much for spending part of your day with me. And my shenanigans. It's always a good time here at d Cruise. Alright, so moving right along in the fruity factory here. I don't remember exactly. I don't remember exactly, but I feel like this level in the past has given me a, some trouble, as you can probably imagine, based on how well I'm doing right now. It's, uh, it's a little light on the wild side. Things are fruity and always out to get us. Okay. Nope. Oh, that wasn't cool, but I guess it doesn't really matter because we were headed for the bonus, or for the, the Dixie refresh anyway. Hopefully we can get everything on our first try. Oops. The one thing that's kind of a bit of a but about this level is there's just kind of a lot going on. You just gotta really take your time, or else you might feel a little screwed. And I totally understand that. I'm not sure what this does. Okay. Let's go ahead and ride this one all the way to the top. Let's see what's in here. It's a puzzle piece. But you never would have guessed. Okay. So far, so good, I think. This level is pretty tricky. And it's a little unforgiving. Oops. The sounds of Dixie just shrieking as they both get disintegrated. Kind of brutal if you think about it. Alright, I think that this specific area might just be these two platforms. Ooh, that was close. I don't know if there's anything... Okay. Pretty uncool. He's trying to give us the chomp. Unacceptable. I'm not entirely sure what these fruits are. They're coming down here. Like they kind of look like pomegranates or something. But you have to kind of... You gotta be a little patient with the platforms as they develop. Okay, so we're gonna be constantly accosted by these spinning blades. Whoa. I didn't study the fruit. I was born into it. 
That's how you know you're in good hands. Oops. This is swing and a miss. Ooh, I got bailed out on that one. I probably shouldn't be alive. Yeah, this, this level's pretty tricky. Definitely pretty unforgiving, as I get a heart. Let's go ahead and get rid of Mr. Petey Prana here and see what's around. It's another puzzle piece. The final puzzle piece in this one, if I remember, is a little tricky to grab. So, we're definitely going to try to be patient. That's one of the things you just got to kind of do in this level is... You just got to kind of uh, be willing to wait. It's really easy to kind of jump ahead and try to get everything on your first try. Oops. Okay. We have collected all the letters of the Kong. So, oh, this part is brutal. I remember this being really tough to get the timing down. Okay. Oof. I somehow survived that. Not entirely sure how I pulled that off. I probably used up all my good karma for about a year. Alright, so here we go. More spinning blades. Coming hot. Lots of RPMs, everybody. Alright, here we go. The final challenge. Can we jump on these platforms in the order they are produced? Nope. No, we cannot. See if we can avoid the nasties. That's one of the things you gotta do. Okay, that's not so bad. All right, one more shot. One more until one more shot. It's kind of a good way to look at it, huh? There's never my background as being a musician. There's never just a one more. Or the one more until one more. Okay. Let's go ahead and grab these really quick. See if they're worth anything. Nope, just bananas. Oh boy! Oh no. Alright, here we go. This part, if I do recall, is a bit tricky. We got some platforms here that are in the final scent. Grab all the remaining things. It's kind of tricky. Keep your eyes peeled. Gotta grab that final puzzle piece. Boom, and a life while we're at it. Well done, everybody. That's a first try. Now we're not quite done. And you might be saying to yourself, D Mike, how can that be? Well, we have unlocked a bonus, but not the bonus bonus. So we are now eligible to play level 5-4. But we still have a little bit of work to do. Now my thing is can I remember where it is? <laughs> so bear with me here. See if I can channel the old memory banks. Can I get up here without... Nope. So you actually need to roll jump off that watermelon to... You need to use your melon to take care of this fish of walrus as we progress. I'm going to try to show you exactly where you need to go. For some reason, I don't know why they decided to do this level in the next in the way that they did. I'm not sure I necessarily vibe with it, but it is what it is. Oh boy, my they always jump too soon. I got a little ahead of myself. Because we're getting a little juicy. Okay. So I do believe that the area that we're after is in here. And if it's not, then I will leave and do it again. That's the way she goes. I think it's somewhere after here. We gotta clear this area out. And blast away. Yes. 
this. This looks pretty good. Okay. So this area up here, oops. You're definitely gonna want to have the, oh boy. You're definitely gonna wanna have your companion as I die. Thankfully, oh, Cranky's not the one I wanted. Okay, well, Cranky might still work. There's a bonus. It's a secret exit for y'all. There you go. Boom, got him. That's it. Well done, everybody. That felt pretty good, right? So that unlocks 5A? A? The Canadian level? And while we're at it, let's go ahead and get some toys. Because I keep neglecting to. Maybe I'll fill out the entire thing when I'm done. Let's go ahead and do 20. All right. Probably not doing well. Okay. I don't even know the last time I got a new one was. Got a Cranky Kong toy. The Fugu toy. Okay. I'm surprised. Doing decent. A Lemmington toy. I'm actually doing pretty well, all right. Okay, Tufton. That's a cute name, isn't it? A minecart toy. Sorry. 5A and Sorry in the same episode? Okay, maybe I shouldn't have done Tufton, that's a lot. Okay. So that's awesome, we did it. Let's go ahead and not do 5A. How do we get to 5? There we go. Panicky Paddles. This is actually one where having Cranky isn't a bad idea. So maybe this is going to work out after all. He is losing his mind. That's how I feel. Okay. So far, so good. Let's see if Cranky can lead us to victory. What is going on with this with this boy right here? Huh. Let's see if there's anything suspicious on the ground. I always like to roll into the beginning of the level just to see if there's anything that I should be mindful of. Oh, get out of here. You know what? This level, for some reason, is really keen on this goo. A lot of goo on this level. Oh, no. But having Cranky's cane is pretty darn useful. But I don't really care for Cranky, so I'm just going to switch to Dixie for now. It's nice that the game kind of spots you. Freebie. Okay, this probably looks... Puzzle PC. And it is. I was right. Okay. Let's see if there's any... Part of the ground I can slap around. Mm. Alright, well, there's letter K. Kind of slide underneath this grater here. I've never really seen anybody like grapefruit. Well, I mean, like, I've seen like zesting. Where you use, you take a fruit and you're kind of um, doing the, uh, it's like the skin of it, like a skin of a lime or a lemon. It's a way to kind of add it to uh, your dishes. Give it a little, little tang, little zip. Okay. If I can, oh boy, I was gonna say, if I can avoid this shark or not. All right. Let's see what happens if we, oh my gosh. These sharks are aggressive. Just leave me alone, brother. Stay away. Don't be, we'll probably be well off to collect all these bananas. Probably gonna lose Dixie in the process if I had to guess, because I am very skilled at this game. Stay away from me. What do you think his name is? Chompy? Bites Magoo? 
I mean, he is in the goo. Jerk McJerk face. Also, a wonderful suggestion. Thank you, viewers. Alright. <laughs> Getting these bananas is kind of tough. And I feel like it's definitely going to be a puzzle piece. Yep, it is. Who would have guessed? Me, I guessed. Who? Me. Dima. Oh, boy. Yeah, see, this is one of those areas where maybe having Cranky isn't the worst idea with all these kind of spikes going around. All right. I don't think there's anything under the goo. I don't know if you can achieve anything underneath. So we will carry on. A lot of goo in this level. Game loves the goo. Ooh, what are... Okay. I got excited. I was like, oh, there's a prize. Okay, this looks mysterious. Probably a bonus. It most certainly is. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Grab all these bananas. Oh boy, I'm doing really cool. I gotta hurry up. Speed it up, D-Mike. Not doing well with my jumps. That's my problems. I'm feeling pretty confident, though, that we should be A-okay. Nice. Puzzle piece get. I don't know if that's the second or the third one. There's a lot, so third one. Okay, good. Starting to fret a little bit. I gotta be careful here, because... I don't have... many of the HPs left. Maybe. You need to be mindful. You gotta be self-aware. Take care of your take care of your health, everybody. This is a this is a lesson for health. Okay. This music is kind of trippy. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I don't love it. I don't hate it. I'm not super enthused. All right. This looks like more goo. Oh. Oh. Oh my goodness. I'm not sure entirely how I survived that. These underwater sections though are a little tricky. The swimming can be a little unforgiving, but you do get a little bit of uh, a little of that aquatic ambience lick. I do like that. Nope. Not cool game. Stop it. Okay. Guys, we're back on track. We have half of the puzzle pieces. This is a long level if I remember. Pretty, pretty long duration. Oh, probably needed that. Alright, thanks for the alley-oop there, bud. But first, more goo? Alright. I'm kind of nervous every time I jump down into these. Got these big balls everywhere. Alright. I'd like to have all of these? Hmm. This seems like a kind of questionable way to get a puzzle piece. A little bit too easy for somebody of my caliber. Yeah, this game, I think they really do want you to, uh... They really do want you... To use Cranky. Oh, I probably shouldn't have killed that guy. Hopefully he can respawn. There we go. So there you go. Throw your bomb. Take it down a level. Ooh, finally an easy bonus barrel. This one you can just kind of... Shoot your load at will whenever you want. You don't really have to do too much, and you should be probably good to finish it up in about 10 seconds. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay. We gotta be careful here, because we're still low in health. I don't wanna... Oops, okay. That took a lot of, a lot of health to take him out. He's a thick boy. Alright, another more. Another more. Another dip in the drink. Looks like there's something down there, potentially. Get away from me. Puzzle piece, hanging out in the grass. That probably isn't grass. <laughs> hanging out in the underwater grass. The very common underwater grass that we're all familiar with. Okay, I don't feel like I need to grab these bananas, so I'm gonna stop trying, because I'm doing very poorly. I'm just gonna sneak right past you. There we go. Let's get back on our way. Okay. I can't tell if there's anything under there. I don't think so. So we gotta just pull this plug and Slide on down. See if we can find something to throw with this nice big sack. Alright. 
How about that? Okay. Not my best effort. Yeah, these these levels, this one and the last one, are just kind of... Oh, boy. Is that not enough for a respawn game? Do I need to go all the way back? Oops. No, no, no. Oh, boy. Things are getting dicey. I don't know if that bomb would last long enough that I wouldn't to go and grab it. I might need to do a tactical reset. There we go. Totally on purpose. Don't worry. I'll set you back quite a bit, though. That's a bit of a bummer. Alright. We're doing okay. I like the watermelon bomb now that this world exists. It's kind of the nicest thing. Yeah, I don't have time for you, buddy. We got plugs to pull. Sacks to smash. Alright. Not what I intended to do. I think this one is going to be a little bit more patient. Kind of rushed. Rushed it. You can't rush a good sack slap. Okay. But you can't do that. Yeah, it's kind of uh, unforgiving. If you mess that up, it doesn't give you another chance at it. Totally intentional. I'm just trying to show you what not to do. If you run into those areas with the bombs, they do explode. So, lesson learned. I feel like it's the combination of many bombs all at once that renders trying to use one for my purposes pretty moot. Okay. So this is going incredibly well. The game sense it. It's like, have a heart, literally. You need it. You're not doing so good. Alright. Third time's the charm. Let's see if we can do this correctly now. I like that sound effect. Okay. That is, uh, how do you say, super, super not cool. Alright, so these look like they're just been the coins, but... I'd like to think there's probably a uh, puzzle piece hidden amongst... Where am I? Oh, did that not work? There it is. You gotta be quick about it. Okay. One more puzzle piece. Okay. Let's see if we can find that last bad but Oh boy. I am nervous. So you just gotta kind of swim. Oh my gosh. Oh, that animation was brutal. I was not expecting that, to be honest. Okay. So you gotta swim, show whether you're a top or a bottom, and that will allow you to guide yourself past the, whatever these are. I don't know if I've ever seen a fruit that's like spiky, but. Maybe it's like a durian or something. I think those are good, but they stink. That's one of the things I hope to do someday. If I find the time and resources to travel around and try the local cuisine, like local fruits. Oh, is that the last piece of the puzzle? It is. We're doing great. We just need to continue to swim through the goo. Dodge the big balls. We're almost to the end. I can feel it. Feel my plums. Okay. Brief ascent. Okay. Brief ascent. Okay. A brief ascent. Game. Come on. The bit's only funny if I do it a couple times. I don't know why they thought this was fun. But it's not. They're wrong. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This is tricky. I don't like it. Oh no. I don't want to do this. Please. Okay. 
This is testing my patience. Oh boy. Ah. I feel like you should have given it to me. Come on. You're being a picky game. Alright. So we gotta dodge two cans Sam here. Please don't sue me, cereal people, whoever makes that. Fruit Loops? Is that it? Oops. <laughs> I wasn't done. There was still a G. I can see it taunting me. Man, they really set you back. How about a, a checkpoint somewhere sooner than a million goo miles away? At least this isn't terribly difficult. Once again, it's just a matter of patience. Deftly navigating the purple drank. Whatever this is. Makes me think of, like, uh, grape soda. I'm not really a big fan of fruit-flavored sodas. It's like, um, I expect fruit, like juice, to be kind of, like, sweet and smooth. And I feel like the added element of carbonation kind of... Oh my goodness, I know. I feel like it kind of removes that element of... Enjoyment? Okay. This is so much fun! Okay. Let's see if we can... Actually, you know what? Do I have Dixie? I think I do. I don't know if this would speed this process up in any way at all, but you know what? I have it. I have it. Her. Maybe it will. It does. Okay. We use Dixie's... Oh boy. <laughs> for But for how long? That's the real question. It's not even making me like more reckless, it's just kind of hard to steer. And these stupid spike balls. Yeah, I feel like having the Kong Canyon definitely speeds this part up. I'm not able to double jump. I'm trying to just kind of go in OG with DK and wasn't having the best of time. Yeah, this should, this should be, this is a perfect opportunity for them to give you a checkpoint. But they didn't because they're jerks. Retro, hear me out. You're jerks. All right. So I'm not entirely sure I'm supposed to get this. Oh, there's a little platform right Oh, boy. Oh, this spikes. <laughs> I'm just standing on it. No! As long as I don't back out, I think it counts. Does it? Oh, whew. You know what? I'm feeling lonely. Cranky it is. I don't even remember buying cranky barrels. Can I swat these away? Nope. Game is like, have it. How about as difficult as possible? But we can spin for a while. It's fun. I think they ever get dizzy doing this. Is cranky like a jetpack? You ever had your grandpa ride on your back like a jetpack? Anybody? Anybody ever done that? Okay. This is test my patience for sure, but I think we've already kind of gotten the hard part out of the way. Yeah, that's what I thought. You thought you got me, but you didn't. Oh no! only so much a man can handle. Also known as mandling. Okay. We're gonna stick we're gonna stick through it. We're gonna finish as we always do. We will always see everything to completion. Dodging these big balls as we are so skilled at doing. You gotta be quick though. You might run out of O2. That's oxygen for those of you who got science. Nice covalent bond. Okay. Let's get over to the other side. Bring it around town. Oop, nope, nope, nope. Oop. That was loose. You gotta wait for it to spin the first around. 
and then use that as a jumping off point. I think partly how I get messed up here is that I'm not paying as close of attention to the, to the ground as I could. Please tell me this is the end. Alright. How am I supposed to get this? Alright, so I will tell you now. I'm not going to show it because I have had this video going too long. But right before those sharks, in that pool, there's a secret exit. So if you swim down there, you'll unlock 5D. You're welcome. Just for brevity this time around. But we will take on 5A, 5B next time. So thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for paying attention to this channel and helping it grow. Love all y'all. I'll see you next time. I've been D-Mike. This has been Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Bye.